Hi there, this is just a quick video looking at the variable labels in the Naxport dashboard and also the variable pictures tool. So on this dashboard so far, I've got a chart which is looking currently for the category Aaron Davis and then the descriptors of tackle and miss tackle. So if I edit the chart, I can see that here. I've then got a data label of the category Aaron Davis and the descriptor carry, same with uh, this name and kick. I've added two pictures, although you can only see one currently. So what I'm gonna do now is add another picture. So I right click, new picture, and I'm gonna go and choose myself from back in the day of late. Now I'm gonna position this at 450, 725, so it overlays the other one. But I'm now gonna say that this links to this category. And this will come into play later on. So. What we're now going to do, I've got three photos there and you can only see the top one currently. I'm now going to right click and press variable label. And this time I'm going to choose my category of Aaron Davis just because for now the charts and data labels I've added are based on that category. And then I'm going to go and choose all the different name options that we could do. Okay, I'm just going to skip through a few of these for the people that I know I've added pictures for. Okay, so I could leave that as a player name or I could say select a player and use it as the nickname. So this is the category that relates to the current information on the, um, the dashboard. And then we're going to say what other options we can have. So I'll change that and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go from Aaron Davis to Alistair Murray. Okay, I can see their information and I can see that the images have gone. What I'm going to do now is go to Brendan Campbell. I see their information and the image that I had linked with Brendan. Remember when we added the image, we chose the category to link it to. If I go to someone that hasn't got an image, I don't see an image there, but I can see their data. And we can go to Mark Polk, see their uh, image and data, Josh Bryan, my image and data, everything like that. Okay, so the variable labels and the variable picture tool is something you can use in your dashboard. Right click and use the variable label option to make the overriding change tool. And then if you right click and add a new picture, so this is when you're working in Elite, you can go and add an image, position it where you need it to be. And you could say that this person links with this one here. Okay, then whenever that person's information shows on the variable label, their image will show up along with the data as well. Hope you found that useful.